<laughs> this is kind of crazy. There were lots of laughs and lots of camera flashes as people pitched in money to see their loved ones climb on stage and get their heads shaved. I came here with my aunt and my cousin, and they're the only one who knows about it so far. Your parents don't know? Nope. <laughs> they're going to be definitely a surprise. If you thought that was cute. Really a surprise. What do you call a grandma and grandkid with matching mohawks? A whole lot of money. This hair might not look like much, but depending on whose head it came from, it was worth quite a bit. I was able to raise $1,210. $4,097. Certainly feats worthy of celebration. And even a little Celtic music. Even stormtroopers and Darth Vader himself were there to cheer on the daring participants. And all this fun for a terribly sobering cause. Hair grows back, kids don't. The money raised from this party is going to help kids with cancer. Kids are so important in life. You know, they just, they don't deserve cancer and they need all the help they can get if they get it. St. Baldwick's Foundation sponsored the event. The national nonprofit says it's given more than $50 million to cancer research since 2005. Now, initially, only 25 people signed up to get the new hairdo, but the momentum got going and more than 30 heads met the buzzer by the end of the day. Reporting live in the studio, Adam Belinsky, KBY2 News, watching out for you.